guys let's get right into this video so today i'm working with my first wig they were kind enough to send me this wig to review so this is their headband wig it's in it of course kinky texture is 22 inches and along with that they gave you a few goodies including some gel bobby pins edge tamer and of course a headband so this is how i have been wearing my hair for the past couple of days you guys and i'm not taking it out at this point so i'm just gonna apply some gel to the perimeter I'm using my Arcani Arcani I always say it wrong y'all um, edge control that I absolutely love and of course on top of that I'm using my um, Goldwell styling blue legum jam because this gives me the best hold you guys if you have tight for hair if you cannot ever get your edges to lay click my Amazon link in the description box and purchase that blue legume jam i'm telling you it was just a lifesaver for me so happy i discovered it so of course your standard cap your standard headband wig cap comes with your comb and of course your elastic band so i'm just gonna pop this on you guys have seen it a billion times but here's a quick tip for all my ladies who have a thinning hairline um, or don't want that much tension on their edges. You don't have to use all the combs that are provided. I only use two of them, so right on the edges. Or if you're at home just doing a little work from home and you just need to look decent for a Zoom meeting, just use the one in the middle and then just you know skip the two on the sides. That will help ease the tension and make sure you don't have any type of damage, um, any additional damage or whatnot to your hairline so just a quick tip from me to you next just going in and just lightly flat ironing it this hair y'all it flat ironed way better than i expected which is always great um it did not take me long and doing the comb chase method like i'm doing here worked perfectly um i did have to kind of go over a few areas but not that much it took me no time to flat iron this hair and i thought it was gonna take me like a hot minute so I have no complaints about the hair. The hair was soft. It was flowy, you guys. You can see the movement in it and the bounce. Y'all cannot tell me that does not mimic type four hair because look at that match. It looks so good. So this is just a standard way we've seen it a billion times, but I just wanted to show you guys just in case you were on the fence still about getting you a good old headband wig. So this way is perfect. It's a good, safe way to go. However, if you wanted to protect your edges a little bit more, um, not really have to do all the gel and that kind of thing you can just slick them back add a little bit of castor oil to your edges and then put a really like light silk scarf or something like that headband around the perimeter and you're good to go me however i like to pull mine back just a little bit again think about the products you're using around your edges too they don't have to be super slick with gel and all that kind of stuff for them to lay all the time or you could just cover them up go in and show you guys how I did the half up half down style so I actually saw Simone Charisse do this about a month ago here on YouTube I love her if you don't follow her make sure you do so basically you're just gonna take out some leave out that's all I'm doing here so I'm just taking out the front um, of my head and then I'm gonna pop that um, wig right where the part is so I'll show you that in just a second So this was very easy. Do exactly what I'm doing. I'm just using all three of my combs this go around. So I'm using the middle and the two sides and make sure that they're really secure in there. And then I'm going to um, not like tightly pull the elastic, but make sure that's nice and you know tight, like it's not gonna move either. Make sure it's really secure. 
And keep in mind, something can be secure without being too tight. So if it's giving you a headache, loosen it up, friend, loosen it up. So this is on pretty good. I was a little skeptical, but I did some tugs and some pulls and I was like, okay, this could work. So from here, I'm just going to pull my hair up in a half up, half down style. You guys know how to do that. But be sure to bring a little bit of hair from like the top middle where my left hand is at. Bring some of that hair over, like don't pull it up all the way in a ponytail because you're gonna need that to hide the elastic band. And honestly, y'all, I had no problem with hiding it or anything like that because not only does the extra hair hide it, but the ponytail that I'm doing right now, when that falls, it'll hide it as well. So you should be good. Add in some um, bobby pins if you need to, but you shouldn't need that many. And that's pretty much it for this style. You guys can do some curls and all that good stuff, but you know me, I keep things simple and I left it as is. I freshened up my edges and I was set. I was good to go. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little trick and these styles. I will put all the information about this unit from my first wig down below in the description box. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. All that good stuff, you guys, if you enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye.